Seven. How are you doing today? Who's that officer? What's going on today? I'm moving. Why is it why is it in your business what's going on? Well we heard that Kelly Joe Rogers might be here. Well she's not here. You mind if we look? No, you ain't coming in my house. Y'all come in my house the other night whenever I didn't ask y'all come in. Y'all ain't coming in my house. Who's that? Welcome back to We the People University. My name is Abaya Israel, former police officer, former sheriff deputy. Today's video is posted by a YouTube channel by the name of Keith Garfield. We're trying to help him bring awareness to his situation. Please subscribe and share this video. Today we're taking a look at the Lyon County Sheriff's Office in Kentucky. We're going to look at some deputies who showed up at the home of a citizen and conducted an outer perimeter search without a warrant. So if you don't already know, if the police show up at your home, you don't have to open the door unless they have a search warrant. No warrant, no doors are being opened. But in this particular case, this citizen was moving. He was moving furniture from his home to a U-Haul truck when two deputies arrived and began to question him about a citizen they were searching for. So what do you do if you're outside and the cops show up? Well, the door's not closed. You're already outside. Well, here's the thing. If there are no warrants, tell them to get off your property. They count on you not knowing your rights. And in this video, we're going to see that after these cops were told the person that they're looking for is not there, they start conducting an outer perimeter search. Even though they did not enter the home, they still violated the rights of this citizen. These cops are getting worse by the day. Let's take a look at this video. We'll take a deeper look in a second. Seven. How are you doing today? Who's that officer? What's going on today? I'm moving. Why is it why is it in your business what's going on? Well we heard that Kelly Joe Rogers might be here. Well she's not here. You mind if we look? No, you ain't coming in my house. Y'all come in my house the other night whenever I didn't ask y'all come in. Y'all ain't coming in my damn house. Who's that? Y'all and the damn state trooper. Y'all ain't coming in my damn house. It's freaking harassment and I'm filing charges money. Okay. Go for it, Zero. I am, bud. I don't care way. either with a spoon. What's your name, sir? I've been fair with you all along. No, you ain't. Y'all filed charges on that car, and by God, I didn't do it, and you know I didn't do it. There's four other people that was involved in that car, and you did not even talk to none of them. Sure did. Sure didn't. But I went hop down serving search warrant. Sure did. You didn't go talk to a lot. Ain't none of your business. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I just hate y'all harassing me. I hate that Kelly Joe's even connected to you. I'm hated that you're, you're standing in my damn house. I'm hated that you follow my daughter and granddaughter out of my house the other damn night. What? Yeah. When my granddaughter my daughter come get my kids Sunday night, y'all follow them all the way out to 24. Yeah, I know. What yeah. Y'all did. One of you did. One of you did. What me? Y'all turned around when they pulled out my driveway picking up my grandbabies and then y'all come down here the next night and said y'all had to respond to narcotics activity i ain't got no use for it and then y'all come in my house the other night after i was told to stay outside i don't know who you're talking about the state trooper hoats and suits y'all wasn't involved and the other one the other one yeah i don't know who the other one was i don't know what you're talking about but y'all welcome yourself right here in my living room and hollered at me, told me I need to stay where y'all can see me. That's now I'm fighting it to the max, baby. Fight it. I am. I am. Bet that. I hope so. I am. I am. Sorry you're having all these problems. I'm sorry you're harassing me and Lyon County Sheriff's Department's got it out for me that's why I'm fucking moving because Lyon County Sheriff's Department all of them is pieces of shit. and that's fact no. all right so y'all are welcome to get to my driveway Kelly Joe's not here all right goodbye you need to work on your ass to get the hell out of my driveway I ain't threatening I got it all on camera, baby. I ain't threatening. Y'all dismissed. Out of here. So here's the question. Can a cop take a look at your property and seize contraband or evidence? The answer is yes, but it's how he does it. The plain view doctrine. 
Plain view doctrine is a rule of criminal procedure which allows an officer to seize evidence of a crime without a warrant when the evidence is clearly visible. This doctrine acts as an exception to the Fourth Amendment rights to be free from searches without a warrant. So the truth is, yes, cops can look at your property and they can seize evidence of contraband, but they must do so from public property. They cannot step onto your private property without a warrant. And if they do, you kick them off. And if they violate, you sue them. Kelly Joe's nowhere around here. To see the full video, click the link down below in the description section. This citizen has been trying to follow up, but has been receiving a bit of a hard time. So hopefully with our support, we can push this process along. So be sure to share this video and let's get all the people, we the people involved to help this citizen stand up for his rights. Make sure you know your rights. Don't let these tyrant cops step onto your property and violate your rights. Don't let them violate any of your rights. Make sure you learn your rights. With that being said, we the people university signing off.